I just wanted to let you guys know that right after I had my dinner, it was gone. Disappeared, poof, into dry air. Lip gloss has left the building. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Shemaine and I do lipstick swatches. In today's video, we're gonna be swatching the Smashbox Gloss Angeles Trio. So this trio is valued at $29, but you can still find this on smashbox.com for $11.60. These came out a while back, but they're still on the website, so that makes this video still very relevant. Thank you very much. And it includes a Hustle & Glow Rose Gold Shimmer. By the way, this is also a reusable box. And I did the uh, Be Legendary Lipstick Trio in a previous video. If you want to go and check that out as well, it also comes in a nice reusable box. It looks the same way. All right, so it comes with a Hustle & Glow Rose Gold Shimmer. All right, it comes off like this. And this right here is the shimmer and then there's an extra shine which is crystal clear and that's the middle one and the last one is celeb Sidon, which is a mid-tone berry right here so we're gonna go ahead and start of course with the extra shine which is the simple clear one because we all know how this is gonna turn out there's not gonna be any surprises here I like that the tip helps you to get to the inner corners of your lips. This is pretty much scentless. I don't smell anything whatsoever. It feels a little bit more on the thicker side uh, compared to a lot of other lip glosses that I've tried. So when I press my lips together, you can see how it starts to, you can see some strings of the lip gloss. Typically, I don't like that to happen with my lip gloss. Nothing surprising here. It's a clear lip gloss that you can also wear by itself or on top of another lipstick. Next up, we're gonna do the Shimmer Gloss, Hustle and Flow. I honestly feel like I have this lip gloss already. I just couldn't find it. But that's pretty much the story of my life when it comes to all my lip glosses anyways. I always have something that looks pretty similar. Love the flat paddle doe foot applicator. It's very flexible. So as you can see, it's bending as I apply the gloss. So that's really nice. Bends right around the contours of my lips. And I can appreciate the ease of use for this lip gloss. I also don't smell anything. It's very iridescent. It's a lot more playful and fun. It's also great as a topper for your lipstick. If you wanna take it up a notch, this will be a great choice. The only thing is that I feel the glitter on my lips and I'm not sure how this is gonna turn out the longer I wear the lip gloss, but give me a thumbs up if you guys like how this is swatching. And last but not least, we have the Celeb Sidon Lip Gloss. And this one is described as a mid-tone berry. You know what? This is actually a very pretty color. I thought it was going to be a little bit darker but I'm okay with this shade so it's nice and appropriate for work and you know it can get fun and flirty for happy hour after work so I'll definitely take it as far as the stickiness of course I always mention that all lip glosses are sticky uh, there's just a different level or degree to the stickiness and these I think it's pretty decent of course, lip glosses will transfer. It's the nature of the product. They're not expected to last for a very long time. However, 
Um, I have worn lip glosses that give me a decent amount of wear time, so I'm curious to see how long this is gonna last, if I'm still gonna have at least some shade left on my lips after a long day. It is 2.48 p.m. so let's just call it 3 p.m. and I will check back with you guys later on today. I'll probably have dinner around 5 or 6 and probably have some snacks after that and then I will check in with you guys to let you know how this lip gloss performs. So I'll see you later. Hey guys, so I am back. Good to see you again. So let's do a quick time check here. It is, oh, it disappeared on me, 7.24 p.m. I put the lip gloss on around 3 p.m. this evening. I had dinner around five and right now it's 7 p.m. So the lip gloss was still on my lips from the time I put it on up to when I had dinner. It completely disappeared after I was done with dinner. So this is what it had looked like when I first had it on. It's Celeb Sidon and this is a swatch of it here. And like what I usually do, I am just going to get a makeup wipe so that I can see if there is even anything left on my lips because to the naked eye, it seems like, yeah, it has completely transferred off my lips. But we'll find out. Honestly, there is not much, just a little right there. <laughs> that is what is left of this lip gloss. Is that very shocking? No, because that's just how lip glosses perform. The nature of the lip gloss is that you will have to reapply a lip gloss every so often depending on what your activities are for today. So if you guys like this video, make sure to go ahead and give me a thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe so that you can continue to see more videos like this from me. It really does help my channel and it helps me to continue to provide more content like this for you guys so that you can make a more informed decision. But I wanna thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in my next swatch video. Bye.